your friend. supposed to eat the pine cones you're supposed to bat them away with your new armbands <laughs> good luck with that this time of year they're filled with pine nuts Kong loves them <laughs> yeah but he's supposed to be learning how to defend himself against incoming blasts got that big guy okay here it goes <laughs> <laughs> Looks like he's figured out how to do both. Uh, think we need to keep practicing. Maybe with something less tasty. Oh, that reminds me. Have you seen Anita? She said she was going to make us our favorite banana treats. Guess that's why she needed to go into the city for more supplies. <laughs> oh, mi querida grannies. Hi, Francisca! It's been so long. ¿Qué pasa? I've been thinking. You know that I've been living with Tia Maria since I was little. Of course. That woman is an angel. How is dear Maria? She's good. But, you know, I've always dreamed of working to save nature. I want to be like Lucas, rescuing endangered animals. Okay, but... <gasps> Look! Are you seeing this? I am indeed. My brother may have impressive firewalls, but away from his home base, Anita's signal's coming in crystal clear. Yes, eavesdropping on the elderly is the pinnacle of villainy. You think I enjoy hearing this insipid babble? I'll do anything to find a clue to where Lucas is hiding that hideous ape. Anything. See, 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 a very pretty bird. Hey, Manal, but what does Tia Maria say about you? She wants me to tell you. <gasps> Now this is a fortuitous turn of events. By my calculations, that young girl would not agree. That's because Anita's grandniece has no idea what an incredibly rare giant anaconda is worth on the black market. Or better yet, what an incredible bionobot it could make. I must get a hold of that snake. Please, Lucas, if anything happens to Francisca, to my querida Panchi, I will never forget. Easy. Try to relax, Anita. Jonesy and I are going to find out what happened and make sure Panchi's okay. These biscochos are for when you find her. They're Francisca's favorite, and she'll probably be <laughs> hungry. <laughs> Batteries are fully charged. Let's grab some sky. We are totally on board with the idea. Ah, uh, forget it, Danny. You two definitely have to stay home this time. Sorry. But we don't have any way to get you there. And besides, you're a fugitive, so you're supposed to be in hiding. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. That's the ticket, big guy. Keep hiding, and we'll be back in no time. Oh, oh. oh yeah, bud. That's enough hiding. Oh, oh. Let's do it, just like we planned. <laughs> Keep up with them, Kong! Whoa! What is it? I don't know, but we're going down fast. Hang on! Okay, this can't be happening. I didn't want 
want to be left behind. And you know how Kong gets when he makes up his mind. Besides, you'll need Kong's muscle when you come up against that giant snake. <laughs> no, it could be dangerous. Anyway, how's Kong gonna fit inside this helicopter? Come on! You said you use this copter to airlift elephants to safety. So why not give Kong a lift? Let's see. Because he's heavier than ten elephants? Jonesy can do it. He's a techno wizard. <laughs> Smooth schmoozing, kid. Abbing up the power is the easy part. The flying ape part's a little trickier, but I think I've got something we can use back at camp. Okay, let's make it fast. This baby's on nice and tight. I've loaded a backup battery, too. All right, let's get going. Okay, Kong, get ready like we showed you. <laughs> See, this might tickle a little, bro. <laughs> We have a mission. You saw Masinta Rivers just up ahead. There are a lot of ball patches in the forest. The scars are clear cutting. Well, the deforestation's probably what brought the anaconda this far north. With their habitat shrinking, like the rest of the world's wildlife, the anaconda has to adapt or perish. It's not fair. Nope. But it's why we do what we do, Danny. Rescue gear's ready. Hey, this is new. <laughs> yeah, little surprise I worked up. Okay, triangulating on Ponchi's holophone. Signal says we're right on top of her. Look, it's the snake! Man, oh, Manaconda! It's a monster! Okay, we found the snake, but there's no sign of Panji. You don't think she's inside the Anaconda, do you? We've got company. Richard's hot butt must be after the Anaconda. But how did Richard know about it? Let's see if I can maneuver him in the puncher position. Well, here's one you won't. We're running out of juice. You better finish this fast, bro, before we lose it. <laughs> okay, not what I meant, but sure, that works too. your primitive monkey mind deals with this. Apparently far better than I calculated. <laughs> All right! The 
Kongenator scores! Punchy! Punchy! Guys, her holophone signal is coming from inside the anaconda. Oh no! Mari! No le hagas daño! She doesn't want you to hurt the snake! Ah, Panchi! Menos mal estás bien! Hola, Lucas! Y este debe ser el super famoso Kong! She's scared. Too bad she didn't speak English. Too bad you don't speak Spanish. Huh? Uh, yeah, but I can speak Chinese. Whoa, yes, she. Okay, so do you. But I can talk to the animals. That's awesome, Dr. Doolittle. <laughs> I just wanted to talk to mi tía abuela, but the snake ate my phone. Anita, I've got some great news. Francisca, is she all right? Uh, so, is your name Panchi or Francisca? Both. Panchi is my nickname. Hola, tía Anita. Thanks for sending Lucas. Francisca! Oh, thank heavens! Happy dance! Oh, you beautiful child! I was so worried! What were you thinking? You could have been eaten! I need to have a word with Tia Maria about keeping a better eye on you. That's what I was starting to tell you. We've been talking it over. And Tia Maria agrees it's time for me to come and live with you. Que? You know it's my dream to work with Lucas saving animals. Well, I see, but... Tia Anita, you always promised when I was old enough, I could come to the U.S. and be with you. I am ready. She has my vote. I think Panchi would make a great addition to the team. Please? Oh, come and be with me, my little spider monkey. I have missed you so much. <laughs> I will see you soon, Francisca. Keep her safe, Lucas. Promise. If I'm safe. Step away from the snake and no one gets hurt. works it out. Get out of here and start figuring out how we're gonna save that snake before my brother sells it on the black market. Or worse. 
Your helicopter needs a tune-up. Did you just diss our ride? Great, it's gonna be slow going until the backup battery recharges. The bionics I inserted into the anaconda are responding perfectly. I'd say the procedure went extremely well. Of course, I was assisting. I now have complete control over the anaconda. So now we can put on the finishing touches. My new Super Forge titanium armor will make this next generation Bionobot unbeatable. You hope. How about I test it out on you? Not amusing. On the contrary. <laughs> but enough fun. Any minute now, my righteous brother and his ape will attempt to rescue the anaconda. Speak of it. Confirmed. Kong and company are on the island. Time to have my snake wrap things up. <laughs> Richard done to that poor creature. Whatever it is, it wasn't part of the plan. Sick it to him, Kong! You seem amazingly calm. Like this happens all the time. Yeah, pretty much. Whoa, loco. What could be better than remote controlled revenge? <laughs> trying not to hurt the snake, but he can't take much more. Nail him with the laser net! But I can't net the anaconda without getting caught. Batilla, get the dinosaurs to take care of my brother and his companions while I enjoy my victory. Yes, master. Incoming! On it! Hmm. I have five times your strength. Could it be you enjoy the beatings I administer? I have no idea what you're talking about. Care to go another round? Why not? Not, not, not. Hope you don't mind my saving you from yourself. <laughs> Your prize monkey's about to go down, Lucas. Even with his grotesquely large mouth, he's bitten off more than he can chew. More than he can chew? That snake's really sapping Kong. Do body can zap her back. <gasps> That's it. Help me with Jonesy's backup battery. Uh, uh, uh. Wow, this thing weighs a ton. Lift with your knees. Jonesy. We're gonna try to get the snake to eat this. Genius! Yeah. She'll be okay, right? There's just enough bones to give her a good jolt so we can net her. Kong! Feed her this! <coughs> like this, Kong! <laughs> See? What? No! Don't eat that! Great work, kids. Yeah, but how am I gonna get the chopper in the air without a battery? <laughs> I'm just playing with y'all. I got a backup. This is one heavy snake. We better lighten the load. Danny, take Ponchi and head home with Kong. Jonesy and I will net the snake and meet you there. You cool, Ponchi? You're not scared, are you? <laughs> no way! I'm just sorry it took me so long to join the team. Oh, mi querida. Oh, my darling child. Oh, I am never letting you go. <laughs> Gracias, tía. But you hug tighter than the anaconda. There. That's the last of it. We can reverse engineer this tech and maybe get some insight into your brother's scientific methods. I'm afraid Richard's seriously starting to lose it.
He certainly has lost sight of his humanity to do such a thing to this beautiful creature. Chopper's fully recharged and ready to go. Okay, then let's get this girl back to Mexico before the anesthesia wears off completely. We'll have to relocate her somewhere Richard and his hench bots won't find her. By the way, I managed to retrieve your phone. A little worse for wear, but still working. Thanks, Amy. And oh, gross. <laughs> That's nothing. Right, Kong? <laughs> Snot alert! Take cover! Ow! Hurry! Watch out, watch out! <laughs> Welcome to Kong's world. <laughs> Lucas succeeded tonight, but that trick will never work again. From now on, I'm shielding all my bionic power sources from that sort of overload. Starting with you, Bontella.